So that's the first category, social communities. Let's talk a little bit quickly about the other three categories. The first of uh, the second of which is the media sharing. Basically, media sharing is just online tools that facilitate sharing audio, video, and images. Um, most of the most recognizable brands, at least in the U.S., is Flickr that you can share photos in, YouTube where you share videos, SlideShare, something you may not hear about, but basically it's a website that allows you to share presentations, like this webinar, for example. Um, even though Apple iTunes is really not a social networking website, it is the biggest distributor of podcasting, which is uh, which is uh, for sharing audio. If you happen to have a podcast about lawn care, which is what one of our clients is doing, this is where they want to put it up there. The third, categ uh, the third category of uh, social media tools is blogging. And blogging is basically short for weblog, meaning an uh, online journal. Again, it's not a new concept. Um, again, uh, there are several tools, uh, several brands which are more well-known than others. Obviously, the biggest one is Twitter. Uh, Twitter is rather unique because we consider Twitter as a microblog. Uh, it doesn't allow very much uh, space for you to blog about. It only allows 140 characters. And there are many people who question why Twitter is so big uh, in terms of usage. And the reason is this. Uh, most people digest information in small chunks. It is much harder for someone to read an entire blog uh, or press release about a certain company. It's a lot easier to read a one sentence thing about your company. And it's a lot easier for someone to digest if, a huge amount of information in small chunks. And that's why Twitter is so important. Um, unfortunately, that also means or implies that you as a content provider needs to split the information you want into sizable small chunks. It takes a lot more work on the, on the content provider end, but it's a lot easier to digest uh, on the user end. Um, other brands you might have uh, heard about, LifeJournal is a big uh, blog, uh, blog community, and of course Blogger, which is being owned by Google. And finally, the social bookmarking. Social bookmarking is um, an online tool that allows users to bookmark, tag, rank, uh, organize, and rank URLs. Now, for most people, uh, it is, this is not as important. But if you happen to be a major content provider and search engine optimization is an important part of your marketing strategy, social bookmarking is definitely very important because you, basically what it allows people to do is to rank the importance of the content you're providing. Most recognizable brands uh, online today on social bookmarking include Dig, StumbleUpon, Delicious, Riddick, you name it. There's a ton of them out there. 